All right, everybody, let's get into the content. You know, I love VeChain. VeChain has been an absolute mover. Uh, it's a fantastic uh, uh, cryptocurrency. It's not only just a cryptocurrency, it also actually does something. The tokenomics are fine, it's a smart contract play, and it actually does have some real world applications, and those real world applications are actually being applied right now. So that's why I'm excited about VeChain. You should be excited about VeChain. I think that VeChain has a lot of room to grow. Uh, despite the recent uh, uh, Bitcoin crash because of Joe Biden's announcement about the capital gains tax, we can see that uh, VeChain has uh, also bounced back from its uh, low. Uh, yesterday when uh, Bitcoin dropped to about 48,000 and, and panicked uh, a lot of people in the space, I didn't panic. You know, I always tell people the trend is your friend. You need to have golden hands and diamond hands in this market. Uh, don't panic sell. Things always correct and recover. So, you know, Bitcoin is, uh, Bitcoin is back up now. So that's really fantastic. Ethereum is actually uh, uh, outperforming uh, Bitcoin right now. But let's really focus on VeChain. So right now, v VeChain is uh, ranked 13. And I believe it's still set to be in the top 10 soon. Uh, and today it's up uh, 7% already on the 24 hour change. And if we compare that to where uh, Bitcoin is, Bitcoin is actually down again, uh, almost half a percent. Uh, but VeChain is, is, is you know, coming back with a vengeance. And I think this is really fantastic news. Um, but let's, let's just zoom out a little bit and let's take a look at uh, where we have been on the uh, you know on the one month uh, time frame. So if we scroll down to uh, VET, and this is on the one month uh, time frame, you can see that in uh, one month period, VET is up 120 percent. So you know it's important that you 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 zoom out and then you can see. Uh, you know how these coins are really pumping. You know over the last uh, month. Um, you know, one month change, Bitcoin is down 10%. Ethereum is up 33%. So once again, uh, Ethereum is outperforming um, uh, Bitcoin uh, on a monthly basis. BNB is also killing it. XRP is up 104%. Uh, Dodge is up 337%. I have a video coming out soon on Dodge. Uh, DOT is down 10%. And, and DOT is really, it's really a sleeping coin. I was expecting a lot more from DOT, so I don't know what's happening with DOT. It's a it's a smart contract play, uh, you know. It's a competitor to Ethereum, but I don't know what's going on with it. Uh, Chainlink is up 22%. Uh, 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 Bitcoin Cash is up 56%. But you know, VET is uh, you know doing really decent at uh, 119%. So you know, this is uh, this is interesting. So you know, you really have to zoom out and. Uh, and this will really tell you how things are really performing. So let's take a look at what's going on in a three months uh, chart here. Let's see. So if we look at the three month basis here, we can see that over three months, uh, Bitcoin is up 54%. Ethereum again, outperforming uh, Bitcoin at 86%. BNB, is up a whopping 1,184%. Uh, XRP 300%. Uh, ADA is up 332% uh, in the last three months. Dodge is up 2,745%. Uh, this was this was over 3,000 a couple of days ago before the before the uh, crash. Dodge is up 85%. And you know look let's you know let's look at V chain guys. VeChain is up a whopping 535% in the last three months. So, you know, there's really nothing to complain about if we look at the performance over the last three months. Sure, if we zoom out 24 hours, people are, are crying and, and, and not happy about the performance compared to a couple days ago, but still, VED is up 4%. And compared to Bitcoin, that's that's down 
over half a percent now. So I really think that VeChain has a long, long way to go, and VeChain is definitely going to be in the top 10 really soon. So I think you guys should be excited about VeChain. I'm excited about VeChain. Uh, you know, VeChain token is currently ranked uh, 13th, as I just showed you. That was because of the Bitcoin uh, uh, dump. Uh, Vets, you know, it's up over a thousand percent since January. And, you know, VeChain has created a blockchain uh, platform for supply chain management. And I, and I think we all talked about what uh, VeChain does. It basically, uh, it's a blockchain that offers solutions for supply chain management to business. While most people see the power of cryptocurrencies and blockchain technology as a potential disruptive force for the financial industry, VeChain is aiming at disrupting another huge economic sector, and that's the global trade of physical goods. And in 2018, the total value of all merchandise traded around the globe was 19 trillion. So, you know, VAT, it combines the Internet of Things, infrastructure and blockchain technology, and it's aiming at improving existing supply chains for various businesses. And these things are like essential goods. Uh, are, and we talked about the smart tags, QR codes that en enable businesses to track goods through their en entire supply chain. So, you know, then this tracking data is then uh, put on the blockchain and, uh, and it's also completely transparent. It's easy for everyone to see. And basically it enables the tracking of products from the manufacturer to all participants in the supply chain and finally to the end customer. So I think we talked about all of that before. Uh, you know, they've had a lot of partnerships that's happened uh, this year. Uh, also the, the VeChain Thor token, as I said, you know, it's up. It's up 119% in the past month. It's up 500% uh, in the last three months. It's up over 1,000% uh, since uh, January. So this is really, uh, you know, a fantastic coin. And I think that, you know, I really believe that VeChain has a long way to go. So because VeChain is smart contract capable, it's also possible to create decentralized applications, even new tokens on its blockchain. Uh, and, you know, there's a number of uh, dApps that are currently on uh, the blockchain. And, uh, Right now, there's 10 of them. Uh, 10 tokens have been made so far, and uh, as well as 17 uh, dApps, according to uh, DApp uh, Radar. VeChain dApps are accessible via the Sync Desktop Wallet, which functions as a one-stop shop for everything VeChain. So you can take a look at the wallet. Uh, but yeah, this is the list of uh, the current uh, tokens that have been made on the uh, VeChain uh, smart contract. Uh, and these are uh, ApeSwap, uh, VexChange, Player, Player De Play Descent, VMworld, CrossSell, VPool, etc. So, yeah, people are building tokens and, and dApps on top of the VeChain. So, in terms of its utility and tokenomics, it's still pretty, uh, pretty cool. Uh, you know, and, and VeChain has made significant strides in development and secure some uh, prolific partnerships since last summer. And, you know, some of these partnerships you can see here, you know, big companies, major strategic alliances. Uh, so, you know, supply chain industry is worth 19 trillion and uh, VeChain is the first and only cryptocurrency that's participating in this using blockchain technology to uh, track uh, things from manufacturing to from manufacturer, transportation, and to the customer. So I think this is an amazing coin. It's definitely something that, it's a real project. It's something that will have a lot of potential. And because uh, VeChain's focus is right now in China, and China is one of the largest uh, global manufacturers, VeChain only has a, a positive upside. So I don't think it's too late to get into. Uh, I don't think it's too late to get into VeChain. I still think that uh, the prices are still reasonably good. I still think that there's big upside. I still believe 
that we should uh, at least 5x by the end of this bull run. Uh, and you know, in terms of utility, VeChain also partnered with Travel.com to make it possible to pay for vacations using VAT. So, you know, daily we're we're seeing more and more um, utility. September, VeChain joined uh, the Chinese Animal Health and Food Safety Alliance, which includes Chinese brands such as McDonald's, Starbucks, and Walmart. So these are some of the food-related alliances that they have uh, in terms of uh, you know tracking uh, uh, the supply chain of food and the movement thereof. So uh, VeChain is uh, a fantastic tool, and uh, you know Grant Thornton is uh, on the bandwagon. So from my perspective, if you're not in VeChain, you better get in because. You know, this is not financial advice, but I believe that VeChain has a long, long way to go. Salesforce Director uh, is now signed up and using VeChain as part of his CRM tool. Um, so definitely you need to be getting into uh, VeChain right now uh, before it's too late. Um, you know, we're already up 11.45% uh, since starting this video. Uh, I think we were at 9% when I first started uh, uh, ta taping, uh, producing this video, VeChain is on a tear. I mean, uh, look at look at uh, BTC. It's now it's it's up 0.85 percent. Ethereum has gone up three percent. But look at VeChain. It's up 11 percent. It's it's just it's being a tear. So do I think this can at least 5x by by the end of the bull run? Definitely. Do I think it's going to be a dollar? I think being uh, a dollar is is simple. Uh, VeChain is going to hit a dollar in its sleep. Uh, you know, I I think in the next couple of days, uh, week, we should see v, VeChain's total market cap be in excess of uh, Bitcoin Cash or Litecoin. So I think that you know VeChain's market cap should be around about 15 billion. To 16 billion in the next two weeks. So just do the math. Take the number of tokens available in the market divided by the market cap, and that will a market cap of 16 billion, and that'll give you the price. I think you know it'll be between 16 and 18 billion in the next two weeks. Uh, so guys, once again, you need to take a look at uh, VeChain. Do your own research. This is not financial advice. Also, just want to uh, remind everyone to be cautious. There are scammers in the comments pretending to be me, uh, offering their WhatsApp number, uh, trying to sell you financial advice. Never contact these uh, numbers. Never give any personal information. Never click any links that are in the comments because uh, these uh, links can lead to, uh, you know, uh, some kind of scam. Uh, also. Uh, if you check my links down below, I have some uh, trading fee discounts. I have some cashbacks. Uh, take a look at uh, my affiliate links. If you're interested, go ahead and click them. If not, that's also fine. If you like this channel and you like this kind of information, please give me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe. Hit that like and please share. I also want to shout out to uh, my subscribers. Uh, all my love. And then uh, my next video, we're going to have uh, uh, another a Dogecoin update. And my next video, we're going to announce the person who won the $1,000 worth of Ethereum. That's coming up in my next video. So stay tuned. And thanks for being part of the community.